Hello everybody and welcome. I would just like to thank you for clicking on this video. Today I will be covering the best ways for you to get to the max level which is 20 and get you as high power as possible. Let's get to it. So there is a very simple method that allows you to get to the top, it, but it may take a grind to get there. So the very best way to get to the top is by doing a campaign first. But don't click away yet because you're like, obviously bro, you think I'm dumb? Hear me out. This is a very good way since you might hit level 20 by the end of the campaign, but the best of the best of methods is by doing heroic public events. Not public events, heroic public events. In this video, I'll be showcasing a couple and how to activate their heroic modifiers. So for this public event, you'll see that the structure is shooting out these faint beams. There should be two or three at first. Follow them and shortly after a plate will appear that you have to stand on and capture. Do this on all three plates and voila. That's what I call a freaking easy peasy lemon squeezy very breezy heroic public event. Next up, this Cabal event that has this massive drill has another easy heroic mode activation. As this drill is digging deeper into the booty ground, I meant ground, a Thresher, which is a small Cabal ship, will come down and observe the penetration. Uh, by penetration, I mean penetrating into the booty ground. I'm, I'm, I said ground, I said ground. You have to destroy the Thresher, but if you miss it, don't worry, it comes back a second time. But if you don't destroy it that second time, well then... <laughs> Now we're headed to Titan for the weapon exchange event. This one is super duper uber simple. Spider tank? Oh gosh, wait a minute. Spider tank? I'm afraid of spiders. Okay, seriously. You have to blow up one of the spider tank's legs and it'll drop these arc charge ball thingies. Take them and insert the balls into the holes, not trying to be sexual. So, insert them into the holes next to the shields covering the scorch cannons. You should only have to put one arc charge per hole. There are six holes for six balls. Once you've done that, presto! Heroic mode, here I come. You also have to destroy a second spider tank. Then we have an awkward but super sick hive event. Head inside the room where it takes place and you should find two plates just resting on the ground. You need two guardians to stand on them, one per plate. Then kill the two wizards that are screaming because they don't like spiders either. Once they're dead, look at the hive portal and at the top, right and left of the portal some transparent kind of stuff will appear and you'll kind of make out the image of some sort of shard. Destroy the two shards for the heroic stuff. You can only destroy the shards while you're standing on the plates since that lowers its shields. You only get one shot at this so make it count. And that's all I have for you today guardians. I would also like to mention that after you level up after hitting level 20, you always get a bright engram. I will be doing an engram opening very soon so stay tuned for that. If you haven't seen my 600 subscriber destiny montage link to it in the description and you can click on the icon on screen now thanks for watching and i hope to see you all in the very next video